Don't worry about the next, cause it's your boy Chris with the next. Alright, so today's topic, today's cafe confession. Let me get my camera right. Um, today I want to talk about addiction. You know, because we all are addicted to something. Some of us may be addicted to alcohol, some of us may be addicted to drugs, um, someone might be addicted to a person who don't love them, you know, you just, excuse me for my mess, <laughs> um, yeah, you just have to think about, go back to the place where you were when you didn't have that alcohol or them drugs or that person that you may be in love with who don't love you because it's toxic it's not healthy and you have to get over it sometime now some things are easier said than done you know some things are easier said than done but you have to get yourself out of that try to move on always count your blessings because the devil is alive the devil is a lie, you know, I got recently blessed with some things, and sometimes I do find myself thinking about people who don't matter, people who did me dirty, and then I get mad all over again, over stuff that don't matter, because they probably not even thinking of you, some people can't even remember the shit that they did to you, so, I think that's people's goals is to do something messed up to you and have you think about it for the rest of your life. Whether they know it or not, and they don't think of it, they probably don't even remember. So why should you? You know, you just have to be blessed, think about, don't think about the past, don't even worry about the future too much. Just live for now. And like I said, sometimes things are easier said than done because sometimes I can have a spark of happiness and sometimes I can go into worry mode. You know, and again, it's thinking too far ahead in life. I have to worry about now. I have to think about my blessings and things that I've been blessed with. You know, and I'm just coming to help you. You know, but back to addiction. You know, whatever you may be addicted to, just um, you ha you have to ration it. You have to ration what you do. You know, just don't get hooked on thinking that you might need alcohol to be happy or you need drugs or anything. You, you don't need those things. The best high is natural high. Yes, that's two of my 420 people. Even if you smoke weed, I mean, that's cool, but you know, the best high is natural high. Cause th they do say the best things in life are free. And some of the best things too, you gotta buy. I mean, I'm just keeping it real, you know, I'm not one of these fake YouTubers, you know, so, oh, see my life, ooh, you know, see me, no, you know, I keep it real, and if I don't get a bunch of followers or subscribers because of that, I really don't care, and there's nothing fake about me, I don't break bread with people I don't do, you know, I, I like to keep it real, you know, but addiction is very a very serious topic you know whatever you're addicted to even if it's a person because that could be the worst thing of all you know D uh, if a person is not feeling you or if a person just wants you because of your money you know don't try to create this uh, imaginary relationship with them and pretend like you're in a relationship with them and when they told you you act like we're in a relationship because they don't want you like that they don't see you like that but once you got money once you got connections, then they all up in your face. But then when you ain't got none of that, they leave. You need to leave until you need to respect yourself. Whatever you had before is gone. Let it go. Let it go, let it go, let it go. Just let it go. You know, you deserve, you know, you deserve somebody who actually wants to be there and be there in your life. 
let that person go. You know, as for drugs, you want to preserve your youth. You want to look young as possible. You got to drop that too. You know, alcohol, same thing. Just ration your stuff. If somebody not respecting you the way that they should be, you don't need them. Ain't no bunk beds in the coffin. You know, I mean, that's just what I want to, you know, spit on about addiction. Because, again, we all addicted to something. You know, I don't know what you may be addicted to. But hopefully this video helps you. Hopefully what I'm saying helps you. Now, now, if you want me to talk about a specific addiction, then I can do that. Again, if people can be addicted to somebody they're not really in a relationship with, but they still kick it with, because that person got some type of money, some type of whatever that can help them. You know, some people are addicted to drugs, alcohol, sex, whatever. But, um, yeah, that's just what I want to spit about. If you got any comments, questions, concerns, leave them in the comment section below. Be sure to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Don't be a lurker. You know. Again, I don't do this to be famous. I just do this to help people. I just want to help people. You know, I want to help people be themselves. I want people to help them to become a better self. You know, like Michael Jackson said, a man of the mirror, a broken bottle top, a man who lost his soul, a deep regarded scar they all have one thing in common they follow the, the pattern of the wind because they got they ain't got no place to go they ain't got no place to be you know we all need a little kicking in the right direction sometimes and I, I intend to be that kick you know sometimes I need that kick and this is kind of my kick so yeah, that's all I had to say. This has been your boy, Chris with the next. Peace. I said peace.